In this video, we will install Android Studio Emulator, so the virtual device. But first, we will need to go inside the menu of Android Studio and create a brand new Flutter project, so the second link. Then you will press next and you can change the name of the app for testing, like this. The second part is for the SDK path, so the SDK of Flutter. We will go inside our document and Flutter dev, Flutter, and we will take the path on the finder. We will click X and we will paste it right here. Then you can uh, use the three point to find the folder. And after that, this, the third link is where the Flutter project will be saved. Then you can press next and you can press finish. Perfect. Now we have created our new Flutter application. When uh, the loading is done, we will see uh, some pop-up on the bottom of the screen of the Android Studio program. We will just click uh, fix it for the Colton one, and then we can just remove the one on the right. So this one, perfect. Now we can maximize the screen of Android Studio. And now we just wait that the loading is done. Then you click on this button to open your virtual devices. If you don't have one already inside your Android Studio, you can create one like this, by example, the Pixel 4. Then you can press next and you can download the system image. I will use the latest one, so the air. I will click on it and I will agree the term and say next. And then I will install it. Perfect. Now it's finished. I click on finish and I click on next and finish another time. So we just created our new Android virtual device with the Pixel 4. And now what you can do to open this virtual device is to press on the play button right here. Perfect. As you can see, I have a little error and I will just quit the program. And as soon as I quit the program, we can see that the emulator will pop up and this is because it's a little bit late because my computer is not the greatest. So if your computer is a little bit slow, maybe you will have some difficulty to open emulator. Perfect. If you have some pop-up like that, you can close it. And I will close my second emulator because I add a little bug because my computer is a little bit slow just to install Android Studio and Flutter to show you how to do it. Then when you have your emulator ready, you, uh, for me, I will reopen Android Studio because I just uh, terminated. it. I will reopen it. I will wait a little bit. And then as you can see, the emulator is loading at, at the same time. The emulator take a lot of juice from your computer. So don't worry about that. I will not use the tips and tricks from Android Studio. And then you can see that I have another error. I will just click on close app on the emulator. Then everything should be fine right now. And I will click on this play button on the top of the Android emulator program. When you click on it, the Flutter project will open on the emulator. And as you can see, when you press the plus sign, you will have a count of the number of time you have pressed this button. Finally, we will go inside the CMD command prompt and we will use the famous uh, writing Flutter Doctor. Perfect. We will click enter and we will uh, wait a little bit. So I had an, an error, so I will rewrite it, Flutter Doctor. And as you can see on the second one, some Android license are not accepted. So what we will do, we'll copy the Flutter Doctor Android licenses and we will paste it right in the comment prompt. We will press enter and we will say why for yes on each 
of the accept case. Just like that. Perfect. So the license has been accepted. And when I run Flutter Doctor, now you can see that the license are accepted. Perfect. So we just install the emulator and accept the Android license. See you on the next video.